Om Shanti. Welcome back. We are here with 18th of November's Gauri Basin. We have been delayed for the past 3-4 days and I have not been able to upload the recording. Please forgive me for that. But I hope you are going to enjoy these recordings as you are sharing with others also and you are enjoying the depth of knowledge in this. Beautiful Vartans which have been taken from Avik Twanis of Supreme Godfather and Dada that is Brahma Baba or Adam. So these are very simple to understand, easy to nourish and they are easy to feel within if practiced on a daily basis that means the changes come from within us once we imbibe whatsoever is being spoken about in these beautiful word bands so a similar pattern let's go ahead let's continue this pattern and let's understand what does god have to say about happiness as a fortune in 18th of november's called libra singh supreme father says may you be in a state of happiness with the fortune of happiness by constantly eating and feeding others with nourishment of happiness. First, first is eating self, that means be full of happiness self, and then feeding others with the nourishment of happiness. You children have true imperishable wealth. And what is that? The true knowledge about the self, true knowledge about the Supreme Creator, true knowledge about the complete drama, how it started, how it did it start, and how it's going to come to an end, and again restart. So you are the wealthiest of all. Now, this, this wealth is the wealth of happiness because of the secrets which have been revealed by the revelation of God. Even if you only eat dry chapatis, you understand what are chapatis? Those dry chapatis are filled with the nourishment of happiness. That means world might accomplish a lot of things financially, might have a lot of things, but someone who has learned the secrets of godly knowledge and is able to feed themselves only with dry chapatis, they'll be the most happiest people on this earth as compared to ones who are the most wealthiest too. Nothing more is needed. You are the ones who eat the best nourishment, the chapatis of happiness. And so you are constantly in a state of happiness. Therefore, constantly stay in this state of happiness so that others who see you also become happy. For only then will you be said to be souls who have the fortune of happiness. Now, this is what we are learning on a daily basis in Brahma Kumaris, that how do we nourish ourselves with true happiness and that can only come when we take the seven day course and understand who we are where we come from who god is what is our relationship with him how to take his powers within us how to remove the negativity within us and also what is the future of the world it's all revealed in the seven day course i'm shanti with this